What's up, guys? Asher here, back with another shoe review. And today, we're going to be doing the review over the Yeezy 700 V3s in the Azale colorway. That's right, guys. The first Yeezy 700 V3 colorway is finally here. So, today, we're going to take a closer look into those, actually. Um, I know you guys see the, the, the new clothes coming out. I will be doing a uh, like a showcase video just to show you what's gonna be coming out, and you know how I made it, the price, the the everything, just to get a, just a deeper uh, look into it. You know what I mean? I'm using this, you know, YouTube. I'm not really, I'm showing you guys what I'm making, but like I'm not really showing you guys what I'm making. So I'm gonna do that for you guys. I'm gonna, it's gonna be up a little, but well, obviously it's gonna be up before the the, the release date. I'm gonna I'm gonna get that to you guys soon. So, without further ado, let's hop right into the video. Uh, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And let's go. So, we got the Yeezy 700 V3 in the Azale colorway. Uh, these came, well, I, no, these came out a long time ago, like three years ago. And I think it was in December of 2019. Uh, this is one of those new shoes that just kind of decided to uh, surprise us with. Anyway, try to cop them all day, every day. You guys already know the vibes. All right, so uh, I took L back in December with these in 2019. Easy Day came up last year, took an L with these things too. Easy Day came up this year, took an L with those things again. <laughs> uh, man, I'm, I'm, I'm getting too hype on these L's, but um, because, you know, it was the first colorway, so of course you guys know that the price was just was kicking over there just kicking over there it was probably like 800 900 for these shoes in my size uh but it was it was across the board like 700 over 700 for any size even the kid size like 700 like like a kid finna you finna buy a kid 700 and put 700 on his feet to go play in the playground some dirt and some sand and jump in the puddle with him. yeah y'all parents are crazy if y'all do that but anyway I got them after they sold out on Yeezy Day. You guys already know Yeezy Day was not the vibe. Was not the vibe. Yeezy Day was a uh, was not good for me. I was mad. I was heated. I was flabbergasted on Yeezy Day. So I decided to buy these on Yeezy Day, but not on the Yeezy in the Adidas website. Um, I had to pay resale for these, but it wasn't really not too bad, but too bad at the same time because like why would you how how would like I'm literally on this app 24-7 and you guys just can't bless me with a with at least one shoe on the on the on the Adidas app? Like they're not even blessing me. Like I be on the app 24-7 and they can't even bless me with a with a with with one shoe. Adidas, yo, step up the game, man. But anyway, I caught these for about 273, 270. Like, that's the base, but that's not bef that's before Adidas feet. I mean, StockX feet. So I got these up StockX. Because at that time, that's when, like, as soon as those dropped, they're, like, StockX was already dropping the prices down. Like, gold. I tried to cop it on gold. It was way more expensive than StockX. So I was like, yo, I'm just copping off StockX because I'm like, I ain't even, I ain't gonna wait for none of that. So I copped in on StockX. Came in, same time I got my eye rats. Uh, if you guys haven't seen that video, make sure you guys go watch that video. And then I got them, boom, bam, bow. 
So here's the box. Just a regular 700 box. Oh, let me get my other, uh, my other side of the look at. Easy 700 meters. Easy 700. I don't know what this is, um, but you get my size right though. My size right here. 11 and a half. You guys already know that I go about full size uh, when I'm doing my uh, when I'm doing my easy 700s. That I'm doing the seven. When I'm doing the 700 V3s. And so just gonna open this bad boy up because everything. B. This too is very narrow, very narrow. So that's why I went up a full size. I suggest you guys do the same thing too. Some people are actually going up a, a whole size and a half. Now that's, now that's, now that's pushing it. That's pushing it. Yeah, so I just say, I, I suggest you just going up a full size. So as you open the box, you're gonna be uh, blessed with the 700 uh, Azales. You know, uh, it's, it's Arat. Zales, all these God given names from the Bible, I think. I'm not sure, but that's the kind of what you're going for. So, this the first of first is gonna be it's always gonna be a God name. So, this one got right here. Uh, I've been one of these for like the, the the man. I've been one of these for the longest time, man. Like the longest kind, the longest time can't even describe how long I've been one of these. This that that creamish white color, you know. As you guys look at it, you guys want to think, oh, that's y'all girls in the dark. No, nah, don't even think about that. But until you turn the light off, that light off. Nah, I, don't know, I got too much light, man. But anyway, um, still. These right here are like one of the one of one of my top top five shoes. Oh man, I think I'm gonna make a, a top ten uh shoes of my collection of 2022 list. Uh yeah, I'm gonna make that at the end, at the end of the year, like top five, top five and top ten. So anyway, these right here, the creamish color. You got this this cream, so the cream actually matches this uh this uh glow cage because it actually goes on dark. This right here is a rubberized, rubberized touch feeling. This uh, I forgot what it's called, but this uh, I think it's near brim right here. This whole sock liner is like literally one piece. Yeah, it's literally one piece. It's just black. Then you also have the these uh, these uh, reflective what's it called? It has a reflective right here at the front of the toe box. You know, Kanye Weston is always trying to get some something reflective. And then you have this white, just white, you know, I would say a flash trail, a flash trail. And then, honestly, I would say that they're trying like to hint at the, either right here, the, the three Adidas stripes going up on the sides or for, with the actual liner beneath it. And then also the three Nike stripes going up like this. But, you know, that's just, that's just my, that's just my, what I think. Might, that's not like that might not be true, but that's what I think. So then you also have this translucent uh, translucent cage right here on both sides. So one right here, and then you also have one right here. And then on the back, you actually have the Adidas the Adidas logo right here, which is really subtle. I mean, if you're wearing it, you're running, nobody's gonna notice it, but like it's there if somebody were to pick up your shoe and inspect it, right? And then on the bottom, amazing, the light blue with a dark blue like that right there is really amazing that's what i really liked it for. like i really love those shoes i love these shoes just because of that even though nobody's gonna be seeing it like i am i still love it because like it's just it's just something that you wouldn't expect on one of these shoes like you would expect it to be gum or you know same color as, as the top but like it's it's there and it's amazing a frost blue with the icy blue like amazing and you guys, uh, as you guys do know, these do not come uh, with the boost. Um, this is why they are so cheap. Other uh, from the other uh, Yeezy 
700s because I think the price went from 260 to 300 for a Yeezy 700 in any other colorway. Even I think even even the Yeezy 700 uh, minivan uh, lacelets are more expensive than these, or way more pricier than these. I think it's like 210. These are like two uh no 220 for the uh for the lacelets and these are 210 which are you know i mean you pay more for the boost this combo but this is with uh ultra light insole same uh with the 500 uh 500 uh midsole which is still comfortable so i mean you still i mean nothing to really complain about i really don't feel the difference but some people may do and these actually do come with the laces these are not infinity band laces like the other shoes that I like that is 700s um very nice shoe very nice shoe. let me show you guys my uh 700 uh mono soft flower this oh I said mono soft flower these are the these are the the, the fade cardinals on my phone I forgot my shoe I forgot my shoe now these right here these you can obviously see that these are the first ones ever and then i just transition to this one right now you'll be like man it's came it has come a long way it has came a long way man i mean with the fade just a lot just added on to it like man i mean but these shoes right here like all the 700 v3s aren't really going up like they really aren't hitting that high price the high demand price that everybody's been looking for which is pretty, pretty good in, in cases like me because I never, I mean, I'm never able to cop it for retail. But now that the, you know, the hype has died down on those, I mean, I still like the shoe, whether the price is up there or not, I still like the shoe. So I'm, so more 750s are coming out, I'm still able to cop them for retail. Thank you for the people that don't be copying it and trying to resell it. But overall, these shoes are a good one to have in the collection. Uh, I pay around 300 for these uh, after the StockX feeds. So would I suggest you guys get these shoes? Yes, yes, indeed. Uh, very nice shoe color to have in your colorway to have in your uh, your arsenal of shoe collection. If you are collecting, if you're if you're collecting or you're just going out to wear, these are also just a great shoe to wear. I mean, these go with anything basically. You can put these on with a nice cargo, you know, a nice cargo. I mean nice black pants that jeans yes it's just an overall good something easy something to style so without further ado we're gonna put these on feet see what they talking about see what they look like and that's gonna be it make sure you guys go check out the clothes that are on the website more are coming soon and I'm also going to be doing an uh, actual detailed uh, review over the new coming clothes that are coming to the website. I mean, as you guys can see right now, actually, these are actually handmade. So, so I actually put the spikes in this. Oh, no, nah, I'm not going to do too much. No, nah, I ain't going to do too much. I ain't going to do too much. So, go ahead. Like, comment, subscribe. And see you guys later.